This little thruster produces 75 grams of thrust. Woo! I set out to build the most compact, powerful thruster I possibly could. MHD thrust works best with water, but they both rely on electrified mediums in order to create thrust. This design is a good starting point, and being entirely held together with magnetism makes disassembling it for repairs super easy. You might have noticed I use brass for the electrodes as well. This is because electrolysis causes an oxide layer to build up on the electrodes, which can be resistive. The oxide layer on brass is still quite conductive, so brass maintains performance over time. Woo! This was really exciting, so I bumped it up to 15 volts. Oh, look at that. And for a full send, I pushed it to 25 volts. For a first prototype, I'm really pleased with it.